Good at more. <clears throat> I already screwed up my intro. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to uh, Haiku Friday. Today is January 21st, 2022. And I would like to welcome you. Yes. Um, Hope everybody's doing well this morning. We've got uh, got a lot of haikus. I'm really pretty doggone stoked about how many haikus we have. I, I usually, we've had a, a couple new people, maybe people who've given us haikus before. Um, maybe it's been a while and definitely we have a premiere of a brand new haikuist. So, Excuse me this morning. My hair is a little wet. I decided not to dry it. Um, what can you say? All right. Let's get going with some haikus. Haiku Friday, January 21st, 2022. This might be the epitaph for humankind. Quite predictable. That's from Brad. Now, I think Brad has sent me haikus before, but it's been a while. Brad, that's lovely. Uh, I think we can all get on board with your sentiments, but, you know, we're doing art here, and we're the art lifeboat that we're going to do every week here. And so um, it may be our epitaph, but it's not going to be a stone around our neck, right? So Brad's an artist too. Brad's a great writer and a piano player and my neighbor. And uh, it's, I'll tell you what, it's easy in my neighborhood to love your neighbors because we have wonderful friends in our neighbors, especially Brad Netta. All right. Thanks, Brad. All right. This is from my pal, Dan. And Dan and I used to spend some time together on emergency calls when I was in the um, fire department. Dan from, uh, from AMR. And, uh, of course, me from SFD. That's got to spell something if you mix up AMR and SFD. Uh, I don't know. It's probably not good. All right, here we go. Here's one from Dan. And Dan has sent me ones before, but it's been a while. Snow plows are rolling, never catching the snowflakes every winter time. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I know, man. They have been just going guns. And I tell you, when you're out running, which I've been doing a lot of running lately, um, I got roped into uh, an online game that involves running talk about that later but it's made me go a little crazy because my competitive nature amongst some things and so uh anyway but you can sure go on when you go on the road that's not been plowed it is ice with water running over it so if you're out there uh hopefully you've got some good spikes to put on your shoes when you're out there running and uh then you don't care about the snow plow too much all right thanks dan now we have a couple from Ericus. Ericus had sent me these two and said, replace these if you'd like with the ones I sent you, basically memories from his time in Europe. So I said, you bet. I always like to, where are we at now? You know, where, where are we at right now uh, is always to me a wonderful thing because I'll tell you what, I am somebody who can get sentimental and not in a good way. <laughs> so I appreciate when we look at what we're doing right now and what, what are we gonna do going forward? All right, first one from Ericus. Oh, surprise, surprise. His heart still beats without her. Open up a vein. Ooh, ouch, don't open up a vein, Ericus. But I'm glad your heart's still beating. Second one from Ericus. Buckle up, old man. She is in the driver's seat. Mr. Toad's wild ride. <laughs> wow. 
What a great ride at Disneyland. You know, I think for those of you, I haven't been to Disneyland in, oh man, I don't know, 30 something years. It's been a long time. But Mr. Toad's Wild Ride is not one to miss, I would say. Thanks, Ericus, and uh, happy motoring. Now, this was cool because Ericus is introducing us to a new haikuist. And this person remains, wants to remain anonymous. And I could write anonymous, but I thought lacking a name, I'm going to come up with a name for this person. And I'm not sure about their gender and they can correct me, but I'm calling this person Mysterio. Ooh. So hopefully we get some we get a bunch from Mysterio because these are good. These are really good. Tell me if you don't feel like you've been transported to a different place in your mind uh, listening to these. All right. First one from Mysterio. Journey to create. Cruel muse. Amused. Abandon. Medusa stone. Mute. Ooh. And that, that was beautiful. And Mysterio uh, titled this one, Muse, which is apropos, I would say. Uh, and we have a second one from Mysterio. Standing amazed, nature's wonderments, beauty of slugs and redwoods. Oh, how blessed am I. Ah, yes, how blessed am I. I think I might have made that blessed, which wouldn't work. So we're going to say, how blessed am I. And so, yes, aren't we all? Thanks, Mysterio. Those are beautiful. I can picture myself. I can smell the redwoods um, reading that one. I could just, I'm back there in the, the nice ancient loam under my feet. All right. Thanks, Mysterio. Hope there's more coming from you. Here's one from our pal Rico-san. Oh, and Rico-san, again, I wouldn't say he's our resident. I wish, but he is our, uh, he is our reigning philosopher, poet, warrior, king. Rikosan says, the river progress delayed, indefinitely behind the high dam. Oh, you know what? Uh, I have, so there's some formatting issues here, and I'm going to read that again, because that did not, uh, when things get mailed to me, sometimes if there's formatting to them, it gets a little screwed up. So, um, I'm going to do that again, because that did not do justice to Rikasan's lovely poem. The river progress delayed indefinitely behind the high dam. How do you like that? Okay. Whew. All right. That's, uh, yeah, right on, right on Rikasan. All right. Here's mine. From Maeve, me. Twisted cowboy art, trans gunslingers and sheriffs, painting the wild west. Yes, that's the latest project I've got. I don't know why, but maybe maybe it's my time in Arizona. I, I really got kind of um sucked into Western art, rediscovering silver and turquoise jewelry and and all that from my time down there. Again, not going to get sentimental, not a good place for me to be. But uh, the Western art really appealed to me. So I'm making Western art um, with uh, trans characters in place of the usual characters. And um, that would be trans men, trans women, non-binary gunslingers, perhaps. I don't know. But all I know is yesterday, for the first time ever, I painted a horsey. A horsey with a sheriff. I've got a sheriff. i got to put a sheriff on 
the back of the horsey. I've got another one, a gunslinger one, that I'm eh, probably about halfway done with. But I've never painted a horsey before. And I, you know, as a kid, I had a book my mom gave me, A Black Beauty. And, man, I loved that story. And I loved the artwork. And I should see if I can find that online. It was an old, uh, like a golden book, but it was bigger. Anyway, boy, do I digress. Too much coffee. Thanks for tuning in to Haiku Friday. This morning I was tempted to bring out the bongos. And maybe that's something we, we may want to revisit. Bongo music or ukulele. I could even um, strum some uh, ukulele, make a song out of your haiku if you'd like. Which, if I were you, I wouldn't like that. So maybe, maybe I should withdraw that offer. All right. So thanks for tuning in to Haiku Friday. Go to haikufriday.com for all your Haiku Friday stuff you may want to see. You may want to see some older haikus. You may want to uh, visit the uh, all sorts of crazy stuff. There's links to my other projects on there too. And um, yes, so thanks for tuning into Haiku Friday. Please, I love it when you send me haikus and I love having new haikus. I love reading your stuff and I love your work makes the world more beautiful, uh, fights the good fight, art and beauty and love will always win. So be a part of that. And um, you don't have to send stuff to my haiku, but haiku Friday rather, but you know what? I think everybody in some way can do things out of their own creative spirit and make this world so beautiful. All right. I want to thank you all again for tuning into Haiku Friday. Uh, I appreciate you very much. Take care. I love you. I will see you next week. Bye-bye.